17 mil. Fuck it. Hello everybody, am I here and welcome back to another episode of Road to Max Damage. I just got off of a uh, Dragon Quest stream, so I'm pretty tired, but I just leveled up my Monster Park farm. Hooray! 37,000 XP. Oh my. And with one last purchase, I have paid off all my hard boss party members up to date now. 21 bill. I have 21 bill to my name. That's not enough. I need more. August's Bean Brigade NX has shown up, so there it is. Holy crap, for the second time in my entire life, I managed to get a Primal Essence from Ark. Second time in my entire life. That's stupid. Yay, some meso. It's time for Fairy Bros Cubes. Let's do it. Uh, usual stuff here. Bleh. As for the black cubes. Uh -huh. Nope. Well, I'm back in bronze now. The whole talk about the... Double superior gold expendent thing is bothering me now, and like I could be scaring myself into wasting a huge amount of meso. Anyways, though, uh, let's use cubes. Gonna switch it up this time. I wanna red my shoulder and still black my helmet, though. So let's see. Okay. Mhm. Mm Yikes. Mhm. Mm yeah, just as I suspected. All right, how about you? Yikes, that's unnerving. I always had that thought where it's like, oh, what if I get cooldown and strength? It's like, hmm, would I want a lower uh, cooldown world reaver and mobbing skill and all that? Uh, no, I don't know. Uh, this could be potentially a 20 bill mistake or less if I can resell it, but I'm getting really scared now. I've stressed or probably thought about this for, I don't know, three hours now. And like, honestly, I, I'm good at making meso, right? I can make back to 20 bill. So... Oh, I can't believe I'm doing this. I can't do it. Uh, 20 bill? Yeah. I can totally make 20 bill back pretty easily, right? I'm good at making vessels. That's why I'm good at this game, right? Why, why am I scared? I'm gonna do it. I guess I'll just have to make back the money for vac pets and whatnot. That's fine, I, I suppose. So be it. Uh, oh my god, I actually did it. Fuck. Oh. We'll find out in, I don't know, four months if this was a good decision or not. Oh boy, I can't believe I actually did that. Starting off my journey back to getting a whole bunch of messels with some sales here. Yes, some messels. I have finally saved enough tour coins for another piggy bank, so... Yay, I guess. Two coins a day, that's 70 days for a bill. Plus the... how much? So what, 63 mil per week? So, I mean, uh Just, uh, you know? Okay, got some more missiles. Yes! I finally sold my bonus potential scroll. On oh, this dinky ring as well, I suppose. I fucking lost my buffs, even though I have buff freezers. Love this game. Oh, I'm in darkness. I'm lucky. <laughs> Ugh. Oh. Sorry. No, it's okay. I'm on last life, so I'm in Same darkness as well, so just call it. Ca call the next uh, thing oh, and I'll come out. Right, left, left. I'm bursting. What? Huh? Huh? Darkness. I'm okay, we'll, we'll actually fucking need to res. Res, 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 res. Oof. There you go. 
I was probably good to bind now, but my bind's still down. Oh, okay, I'm binding her. Oh, never mind. I loose it bounded, I loose it bounded. She's dead. I mean, she's dead. Oh. Yay. Oh. My youth! My power! <laughs> Cry more. <laughs> Cry me a river. <laughs> Literally killed you in three different versions. Get fucked. <laughs> Hmm. Nothing. I'm lucky. Meister cube. I want it. <laughs> Nick, pick it up. Go. Loot, but Nick, loot. Nick, it's yours. Nothing. Are you for? Okay, the other guy's better. Step cube. it up. You. <laughs> no, okay, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, one of these things is not like the other. <laughs> <laughs> Me, <laughs> the guy that can't mob. <laughs> sure. oh. Have you tried oh. getting a bigger sword? Like oh. him? No. Yeah. <laughs> I, I have not considered that actually. Uh, dual blades are M tier because everyone is a dual blade. <laughs> what, what has the? If everyone's super, no one. <laughs> no one. <laughs> it's a blast cannon. Interesting. Did you get anything, Vash? I don't know. You don't know. I'm too busy switching my gear, bro. I know I got nothing. Ah, uh, that sucks. All right, it's done. Woo! I saw. I I picked up an Absolab chain. Ah. Uh, <laughs> anything? Ah. Uh, no. uh, I have enough reward points for the. Guardian scrolls now, so let's go and try to enhance my tyrant belt. Gosh, you think I could finish my belt before that uh, patch with the no double black lotus heart? To me, that's just like a hilarious thought to think about. It's like when I leveled from 235 to 250 in Esfera exclusively, and I didn't even get enough droplets to even make one shoulder. That's like the type of shit that I expect from Nexon. Like the absolute asinine, ridiculous, like, circumstances. Too funny, man. All right, let's try it. Okay, first one. Nothing. Second one. Oops. Nothing. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna be stuck at 13 forever. <laughs> Finally, some decent sales. Alright, so, um... A friend of mine showed me a couple of leaks that look to be absolutely true. And, uh, if they are true, then that means fact pets are coming next week. So, I... You know, with my weird big purchase, I need to uh, make back a bunch of messels. And also because the messel rate went down for some reason, I'm not sure what's the case, uh, I need to make more than 10 bill now, maybe 15 bill-ish. I think that would be a good thing. I have uh, arranged with another person that I was going to buy a vac pet from them because they said they were opening and what yada yada yada. Uh, so I sold my Mag Dark No Soul. <laughs> yeah. That means between now and next week, I need to make five bill, which could happen because uh, the next sunny Sunday is 50% honors off. And uh, I've been informed that a whale has basically bought out every Mugong that was cheap. So the prices of Mugongs have actually gone up. And uh, I remember the last mistake I made was uh, not selling them when they were like a few hundred mil or whatever. Uh, and paying attention to the prices for the past month, they've been going up anywhere between 30 to 40 mil. So this is an all-time high. So I definitely want to sell my Mugong honors uh, as Sunday gets closer and closer. It's only technically Thursday for the game. So I think on tomorrow's reset, I'll if these things don't get sold by then, I will um, put up maybe a couple stacks, maybe three or four stacks of honor medals, and hopefully 
uh, that will be good enough to make the remaining potentially five bill that it might cost for the vac pet. Uh, but I'm happy it uh, it's coming next week if it's true, because uh, people were telling me that I had to wait till next year. And I didn't want that to happen because I really wanted to train in Limina or in Esfera. Just the VAC pet would greatly improve my rotations or just make me not have to think about needing to climb to certain uh, platforms or make sure my one of my three pets ends up picking up all the loot. So I'm looking forward to if it happens, but until then I need to work on getting under 5 bill. Let's make another 10 bill just to be safe. Oh yeah, also the Sengoku patch is here now, but uh, I'm not really doing much with it. Just one quick blurb about uh, the past few episodes. Funny thing is like, whenever I edit Road to Max Damage, I always have the issue of having too much footage. And sometimes I would have to take one episode's worth of recordings and split it into two because I thought like that was enough for one like 25 minute video but <laughs> i end up with like a 50 minute or an hour long video um but recently the past couple or few episodes i've actually been uh going under and it was because i spent so much time training that I didn't have time to do anything else so all there was was just footage of me training and that just completely skewed my perception of how long my episodes were but i think i should be good now uh now that i finished editing the level 260 episode so uh now it's all just meso making and honestly that's probably what a lot of these episodes are gonna be now just bossing and messel making and checking out events as they come along because like the upgrading is gonna take a very long time and i gotta wait for events and stuff like that and i don't i gotta save up a shit ton of messel to get any results and all that so well, i hope you guys understand that if i don't have an upload it's just because i haven't had time to edit or i'm feeling a bit burnt out but it's also because of the fact that i don't have anything interesting to record so uh I guess this is the perfect time to plug my Twitch channel again, so if you want to watch me play Maple Live and work on stuff uh, in real time, just go twitch.tv slash shade. But uh, yeah, that's all the heads up I wanted to give you guys, just because uh, I'm finally done catching up to all the editing if, uh, with the, after all that grinding. So things should be a little bit more smoother for me now, hopefully. Alright, some meso. I'm in the middle of an Oz run right now, but my friend just messaged me on Discord to check all the Messel prices, and for some reason, it's gone down, 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 like, literally half the price of what it was. I think it's a result of uh, no 5, 10, 15s announced, and uh, y the fact that the Messel price can just immediately be so volatile, it really fucking irks me. Nothing I do can be consistent, and I will never ever be able to react fast enough to anything. And, like, it just pisses me off greatly over all of this, really. I'm mostly annoyed by all of this, mainly because of the fact that the money I have for the VAC pet is probably not good enough anymore. I legitimately cannot even plan three months ahead now, and I used to be able to plan, like, six months up to a year. It's so frustrating to deal with, I swear. If the prices of things in the auction house actually reflected all of these changes in the meso market or outside on, you know, trading discords or whatever, I would be okay with it. But, like, the stuff doesn't change fast enough. And the only types of players that actually get affected by this are, like, people similar to me. So I am very angry and I feel like I have the right to be angry. God damn it. Oh, but arcane prices are gonna go up pretty quickly. They used to be like 11 to 13 mil, and now they're up to 19. And I can't grab any of this early on because I need the fact pet more than anything. <laughs> HMAG is fun to solo before they... Back like before they had the fucking damage over time outside of his zone. Uh -oh. <laughs> Rip. I can't imagine yeah. having to do that shit now. Ah, uh, I was cursed. I couldn't move. 
That was frustrating. <sighs> that was so close. Almost dead. <laughs> Soon to be dead. There we go. Nice. nice. Natural shit, decline. Dude. Wow, has it been 10 weeks already? Get out of the corner. Um, Bind binding. Bound. 17. Wait, why are you here? Uh, that's okay, dude. We have door. <laughs> but we don't, so have, we don't have the Nick, HP, though. But Nick, go, go, go! Nick, go! <laughs> Nick! Okay, I'm there, I'm there. Uh, I need to get more moonlight. It's okay, you have door. Quick, 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 quick! Quick, quick, quick! Oh, it's hit done, him, come on. Blue, 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 oh, blue, no. blue. Oh, oh, goodbye, I team. Frame, I frame, I frame. I don't, I don't have anything. <laughs> Door saved you. It's yeah. okay. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Easy life. I forgot. I forgot we have to finish. <laughs> Why'd you come over? <laughs> Dead. Interesting. Interesting. Interesting oh. indeed. Saw a Meister cube. Pog. <laughs> Woo. Interesting. Oh, that's like a couple hundred mil. Oh, no, my my pet loot, fuck, sorry. <gasps> Nothing. Nothing. Shiny. Oh, no, there's a damage lock heart. I saw it. I saw okay. it before. I saw, the, I saw it before the text even happened. You got a oh, damage lock okay. heart. Okay. Okay. I got something. Yeah. Oh, I got a damage block heart. Yeah. Yeah, you did. Oh. oh! And look, over the course of the day, the vessel rate just jumps back to 17 now. What the fuck is going on? When I recorded that uh, 1 to 13 rate, that was like in the afternoon. So in the span of a few hours, the mess rate just changed again. I just finished a weekly boss run and I have all these Meister cubes to use. So I thought I would go ahead and record myself doing it. And we're going to spend it all on uh, the Superior Golix ring still. I'd like a good three liner and uh, nothing else. So... Two liners, no, nope, no, no, thank you. Oh, there we go. There's one finally. 27% luck. I am pretty happy about that one. Uh, now it's the question of uh, what do I use it on now? I could use them on the reinforced Golux ring and roll a two liner or maybe try to get it to tear up, or I could try to get three line strength on the shoulder which seems to be the m less likely thing to occur so you know what i'm gonna put them all on the reinforced gold lock string and hope for a good two-liner and if i have anything left over then i'll put it on the shoulder but i'd really doubt that i would get a good two-liner so we'll see though but yay i'm happy the oh int uh i'll settle just because we'll put it on the three on the arcane shoulder. Nope. Not bad, though. I'm pretty happy about that result. Now, I think I'm going to hold on to it just a little bit more and uh, try to get... I think I'll try to B-pot something out of uh, the ring since it's already, you know, legendary what did i sell in the auction house though oh we got that just today and it's already sold nice and it's also time to sell all my boss crystals that i have today except for you know the damien one which you, know, you saw in the footage all right up to 724 mil now now i do want to talk about uh the upcoming kms patch that's coming to gms with the two unique item thingy not contributing to a set or whatever the thing that xenons ruined for us damn xenons uh so for those that didn't keep up with the game kms had a patch a while ago where they made it so that uh duplicates of the same equip cannot contribute to a set count uh, this was because xenons in kms used lotus's damaged black heart to 
put in their heart slot and their emblem slot, I think. Uh, Xenons can put a heart in their emblem slot. For, so basically, they used two Black Lotus hearts to get uh, even more sets in the Dark Boss set. And uh, instead of doing the sensible thing and just making the heart a unique equipped item, Nexon decided that they would make it so that no two of the same equip can contribute to a set count. I don't know why they did that in KMS, but because of that change, many, many people are speculating the fact that that change is also going to come over to GMS and fuck with double superior Golux pendant, even though in our uh, version of the game, you can have two pendants contribute to part of the superior Golux set. In fact, I believe it was a change that they made specifically for our version of the game or something. So the reason why this is a huge deal is because if this change happens, that means we no longer can use two pendants to contribute to the four set superior Golux of, uh, set, sorry. And that means the Tyrant Belt will be replaced by a superior Golux Belt, unfortunately. There's a lot of ifs, ands, or buts, so I'm just gonna keep it short. If it does happen, I'm kind of screwed out of my own Tyrant Belt, and I will have to change eventually. The good thing is that I, what I, my interpretation of the change was that you weren't even going to be allowed to uh, equip two of the same pendant. Uh, in your equipment inventory, but uh, no, they're not making every single item unique equipped. They're just making it not contribute to the set. So you can technically still have two superior pendants, but only one of them will contribute to a set. So again, if the change happens, the only thing I really w would like to do is just switch my Tyrant Belt for a superior Golux Belt. Uh, to get the 30 boss and 30 ignore defense because I did put it through my calculator and it's like around 7% final damage, which is a pretty big amount. Uh, but obviously, if I finish my familiars and all that, that amount would probably be diminished a little bit more. Uh, but it's still a decent amount of uh, stats, though. And that hurts because, like I said, you know, I've always wanted to finish a tyrant as a free-to-play player, but I guess some things are just gonna be left uh, unfinished, I guess. Alright, some decent sales this time. And the muscle rate fluctuates yet again. STOP PLAYING WITH MY EMOTIONS! On second thought, I actually don't like the two-line int on the ring, so I crafted a whole bunch of cubes to uh, re-roll it, so I wanna go for anything but two-line int. So hopefully... I end up with something better. Ideally, I want to end up with two line strength because that's pretty much the go to stat nowadays. Um, you know, with Adele and everything. So, and I don't want two line HP. Uh, lots of top line strength still. Two line luck, but mm, it's twelve percent and nothing. Okay. Hey. Damien super sorry. Defeat hard Damien a hundred times. Damn. Okay, well, I got a monster ritual fan. <laughs> Ho young fan, damn it. And with that, my last castle golem familiar got sold. Honestly, I wish I ended up getting a lot more mess out of this, but uh, with the, you know, Mess already shooting up after Botters got banned and all that. It is what it is. I think to end the episode, I'm going to show off the result of a very, very long project. I have never done this before because of Drat. I kid you not, that's the first time I've done that in like seven runs. For the longest time, I've wanted to do like this mass opening of Oz boxes uh, for a video, but my impatience always gets the best of me. And because an Oz run takes like at least an hour every run. It's quite a uh, time sink to do. But with this final run, I will be completing my project of 10 Oz runs up to floor 41, and I'm going to open up all the boxes 
and share with you guys. I'm so freaking excited. It's also nice to do this because in an upcoming patch, I don't know if it's like the next one or the one after that, they're sort of changing how odd works with uh, some of the cheese that you can do. So uh, it's good that I could do a bunch of cheese runs before I have to go back to actually doing Oz runs properly if I want to go to that uh, department to make messels. But uh, yeah, let's do this. 10 rank 2 boxes. I'm essentially looking for any ring that's endgame and level 4, so yeah, wish me luck on that. Alright, what are we gonna get for the first opening of all time? A limit ring level 4. Ah, oh, I would have been so happy if that was a level four ring of restraint. Oh, level one. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, we got a cube. That's not ideal. I, I would not want a cube after one hour of work. A level four crisis HM. Wow. Stop. <laughs> it's giving me all the freaking level fours on the wrong rings, man. A cubic blade that hurts to see, but that's part of uh, that's part of it. A reflective ring. Oh, that's actually something that I wanted. I won't tell you what this is used for because I'm worried next time we'll do something about it. But it's used to cheese uh, <laughs> again. Cubic chaos blade. All right, we're we're getting the weird shit now. I would really love. Ah, damn it. I would really love to get a level four ring of restraint risk taker or any of that sort. Totaling ring. Ah, oh, level one again. God damn it, man. All right, we got one more box left. I'll just chuck this ring out. All right. What's it gonna be? Let's see. Level four ring. Oh, Master Craftsman's cube. Damn it. But no matter, we still have the box pieces. We are going to go back to Oz for a second because I can pick up enough for another box so I'm gonna just pick up like three oh, we'll take four just to keep the inventory slot all right and we're just going to redeem all of these yes thank you very much so I mean 10 runs gets me 15 opens five of them being guaranteed rings which it like isn't super bad but you can tell this gets pretty grindy all right level four big ring Stance shift, level two. That's not good at all. All right, number two. Stance shift again, level two. Ouch. What are the chances of that happening, huh? Crisis M. That is no bueno. Not good at all. <laughs> Come on. Swift ring, level one. Yuck. All right, last one. What's it gonna be? Let's find out. Clean defense ring level four? Wait, isn't this the one? Hold on. Oh, never mind. Khalifa was looking for a level four cleansing ring. That's, uh, that, that makes more sense, actually. No way around it. That just sucked. It's okay, though. Uh, we'll do this another time, but maybe I'm not going to save up ten, uh boxes anymore i'll just open them whenever i get the chance but regardless i hope you enjoyed this episode there was a lot of money to make and there's still a lot more to make so stay tuned and uh we'll see how this goes all right i'll see you guys next time bye bye <music>